Okay, in this tutorial I want to show you how to do a quick record search with jQuery. Uh, we're going to start with adding some records in here into search through. And these probably should be done with uh, a table since they're data records, but uh, I find it easier to to teach through using the divs, so I'm going to use divs for the purposes of this tutorial. And we'll do one more that sounds like Terry, but it's actually Jerry. Okay, now we have our records over here, and what we're trying to accomplish, I actually already have it over here uh, set up. As we start typing in the search in the t input area, we want to start pulling up records as we type. A neat little uh, quick find tool for your users to make uh, everything easy for them. So now we're going to refresh the page. Now we have a record set up. Now I'm going to create the input field. text and now we have our input field and what, what we want to do on this is try to on every key up we want to look for through the records to see, see if the current string has a match in the records so we're going to start with our jQuery uh, I'm going to start with my document ready function and we can start by grabbing the key up of of that input box so we'll say input name equal to quick finder and then we'll bind key up okay now every time we have the key up we can just do a log so we'll We'll just test this real quick, say console log, key up. So now every time we type in the box, we should get the word key up. As you can see, we're at number three. I have three letters in there, so key up was called three times. OK, now we'll get rid of that, and we'll start coding in our, uh, our vowels here. Okay, so the first thing we want to do is we want to capture the value of the text box. So we'll say var val equal to this dot. Actually, it's a text box, so it's a val. And I'm going to do everything to lowercase so that I can allow the user to type in lowercase tim instead of capital tim in order to get their records that they were looking for. Now, after every key up, we want every single record to hide, and then we'll populate as we type the ones that we want to populate. So right away, we're just going to do all the records. We're going to just make them hide. So now, as a user types, everything is going to be hidden, and then we'll start cherry picking the ones that match. So now we'll do a for each loop of the record elements and now we can grab the value of each record and remember we want to make it to lowercase Now we'll do our if statement to check if the value matches the text. So we'll say if text dot index of val does not equal negative one, then we should show the record. So we'll say this dot show. Okay, now that should have the desired output. Uh, we'll go ahead and test this. 
so I'll refresh the page and now as we start typing Tim we get Tim as you can see if I do a capital T I M we also get it if we start typing E R R Y we get Terry and Jerry start typing John as you can see everything's working there and that's how you build a quick find for jQuery